In this tutorial, we're going to be fitting an oil cooler to the BMW R19. Now, oil coolers are one of those things, they're a little bit divisive. Some people prefer not to fit them because they prefer for the airflow to travel through the um, oil cooler to make sure obviously that the bike temperature and the oil temperature doesn't get too hot in the bike. Uh, some people live in much worse uh, road conditions, climates, weathers, and therefore they want the extra protection because they'd rather that a stone didn't go through there. So it's something you're going to have to balance out depending on your, you know, your climate, your riding conditions, that sort of thing. We do find they are a very, very popular mod and they're extremely easy. One of the easiest things that you can fit to the BMW R9 T. So there are many different brands that fit, uh, produce oil coolers. We're going to fit one of the black unit garage ones now. All I'm going to need to do that is a T30 and about three minutes. I'm probably not even three minutes to be honest. So you can open the box up, just do a little unboxing as well. It literally comes with the cooler which is still, you know, it's well ventilated. There's plenty of space on there for, um, for air to pass through. And then a couple of pads on the back. Basically, they're gonna sit in here and across the sides in order to just sort of um, make sure there's a nice snug fit across the oil cooler itself. So, I'm gonna fit this with the T30, with a ratchet, one tool, simple job. And in about one minute, I'm gonna say, there you are, we're done. So when you come to fit the cooler itself, you can see it's got the bracket on the bottom. You simply pop that up and over the top and pop it over the front and then do your bolts back up. And that is the entire fit, nothing else to worry about. And there we go, one oil cooler cover fitted. Like I say, it's a slightly contentious part because some people on the, you know, the forums and places like that will say that it's gonna interrupt the airflow. Realistically, it comes down to personal choice. Am I gonna fit one onto a race bike? No, I'm not. I want as much airflow in there as possible. Am I gonna fit one if I know that I'm going through a, an autumn ride through the Alps? Quite possibly. Certainly on the UK roads when you come to commuting, it's cool enough on the outside air temperature to know that it's not necessarily gonna overheat the bike and there is a lot of crap in the roads and they are potentially gonna get thrown up by other road users and even the front wheel. So yeah, potentially I am going to. So judge it by your own conditions, but from a fitting point of view, super easy, super quick, two bolts. Have a quick look on peercitycustom.com and just use the filters to find the, um, the oil cooler covers and go from there.